Good afternoon, everybody. It's Zechariah from Running Through Heroes. Today we're doing one mile, and it's for a fallen police sergeant who lost his life in the line of duty. Today I'm running for fallen sergeant Stephen Gibson. He worked with the Somerville County Sheriff's Office in Texas and his end of watch was December 13th of 2023. He lost his life after a car lost control on a wet highway and struck his patrol car head on. He was 53 years old at the time of his passing, serving 26 years of service with the Somerville County Sheriff's Office. He leaves behind a wife, two children, and grandchildren. That I'm running with the blue line flag in his honor. I'll be doing seven laps around the track of my school. The eco of in his honor. And today I'll be joined by three Winter Springs Police Department cruisers, along with many other supporters and my family. Before the run starts, I'm going to do a prayer in honor of his whole family and department that hearts and are going through, and then I'll be on my way. For those that are tuning in today, today is Zachariah running one mile in honor of a fallen hero from the state of Texas who recently lost his life in the line of duty. This mile tonight is in honor of fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson. He worked with the Somerville County Sheriff's Office in Texas, sadly on December 13, 2023, lost his life after a car lost control on a wet highway, sadly striking his patrol car head on. Sergeant Gibson was 53 years old at the time of his passing, having served a total of 26 years as a member of the Somerville County Sheriff's Office. He leaves behind a loving family that includes a wife, two children, as well as grandchildren. Zach Rack completing his first of seven laps today, which is one mile to honor the life of fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson here today. I was appreciative of the various local agencies that continually come out to help honor our fallen heroes alongside our youth runners and tonight helping pay tribute to fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson. We have multiple members of our home agency, the Winter Springs Police Department, here today. Also running with Zachariah, one of our local supporters, as well as Zachariah's little sister, Chloe. Once again, we're here today to pay tribute to fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson from the Somerville County Sheriff's Office in Texas, who tragically, on December the 13th, 2023, lost his life after a car lost control on the highway, striking his patrol car head on. Sergeant Gibson, 53 years old, Thomas Passing, was a 26 year veteran of the Somerville County Sheriff's Office in Texas, sadly leaving behind a loving family that includes a wife, two children, as well as grandchildren. Zachariah completes this lap. He'll be completing his second of seven laps tonight to honor the life of Sergeant Stephen Gibson here this afternoon. For every mile that is completed by our youth runners, they carry a unique flag. Each flag gets sent to the family of the hero that they run to honor. Today, Zechariah carrying the blue line flag. This flag will begin to work its way to the family of fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson, along with the note that Zechariah wrote earlier in the day. If you'd like information on how you'd be a part of the Running for Heroes organization, you can visit our website at www.runningthenumber4heroes.org. As Zechariah completes lap number three and begins lap number four, I'm going to go silent. I'm going to remain silent for the remaining four laps to reflect on life that's here today. Fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson. We extend our heartfelt prayers to everybody with the Somerville Police Department in Texas mourning the loss of this hero today. We also offer up our prayers to the entire Gibson family, including his wife, his children, and his grandchildren. Our hope and prayer is that the run this afternoon honors him well, and we thank Sergeant Gibson for his 26 years of faithful service to his community, to his agency.
It's not for any final words this afternoon for the family of Fallen Sergeant Stephen Gibson. To the entire family of Fallen Sergeant Gibson, his wife, two children, and grandchildren, and all of the members that he made friends with during his 26 year service, uh, we hope all of you very soon through this loss. Sergeant Gibson lost his life in an accident um, that wasn't really any, anybody's fault except Mother Nature. A car lost control on a wet highway causing the car to strike his patrol car head on. Driving in any condition that's not clear um, is very dangerous. Um, that's why this run I inspire all of you guys to continue to keep your eyes on the roads and keep all safety and focus on the roads, especially during conditions like this, because it definitely saves lives. Um, because of this unexpected loss, we hope Sergeant, Gibbs, Sergeant Gibson's family can heal through this run and Texas as a whole can heal, because I know they have so many losses they have to endure every year. So part of the family, I'll be sending this flying flag very soon along with a handwritten note. We hope and pray this run just helps you out through this significant loss. At this time, Bobby and I join us in a 21 second moment of silence. Just like a 21 gun salute each second day came, one amazing thing Sergeant Gibson during his life. Following this will be a prayer, so this time please join us in those 21 seconds. Dear Heavenly Father, today we did a one-mile run for our fallen sergeant out of Texas. God, I pray you watch over his whole family and department along with everybody involved in this accident. God, I pray you guide all of them to safety and comfort. And I pray you guide them to this run so they can find support through this difficult loss. God, keep everybody in that county in your prayers. And just pray. Amen. Thank you for joining us in this, in this one-mile run. Unfortunately, we still have a lot to do, so we'll be doing two tomorrow. Uh, stay tuned for those miles. We hope all of you have a great and safe rest of your day, including if you're a first responder serving today. Hope you have a great Christmas coming up, and I pray God blesses you all.